exercises, which our first round of exercises are going to be a curtsy lunge with a lateral step and a skip. So what's going to look like is we're going to do a curtsy lunge, we're going to come up, skip, sorry, skip, curtsy lunge, lateral step, curtsy lunge, skip, then it loads back again, step, curtsy lunge, knee comes up, it loads back without touching the ground, and back too. One more time, real quick, so you're going to jump laterally, you're going to go into a curtsy lunge, Hop out of it, load that foot back again, not on the ground, then jump over. Curtsy lunge, load, and over to the side. If it makes more sense, you can touch it back down the foot. I'm gonna do 30 seconds of those, and then we're gonna do 30 second lateral lunges 
with an RDL on each side. We'll look at two of them as we go through. Right now we're going to start with 20 seconds of pull squats to start this round off. 20 seconds pull squats. So we're staying right in that low squat, pulsing through. So we're going for three, two, one. Here we go. So we're just pulsing it out. High chest, driving knees out. This is why we just sat in that deep squat to prime all these muscles up. It's only 20 seconds of it. 10. Three, two, one, 20 second rest. So now we're gonna go into 30 seconds of those skaters with the curtsy lunge. So you jump laterally, curtsy lunge, jump out of it, load again, and go across. What are you doing, where's your treat? All right, we got 30 seconds of those, and then we'll do 30 seconds of the lateral lunge RDLs. All right, you guys ready with me? So in three, two, one. Here we go. So you're going to lateral lunge, curtsy, knee comes up, back over, curtsy, pop out of it, load that leg, back over, curtsy, knee up, load that leg, back over, curtsy, drive up, load again, back over, load that leg, back over. Do you have enough room? Nope. Back over. In three, two, one. We're resting. We're going to go this way? Yeah. All right, and then we're going to do lateral lunge with an RDL. So you're going to go lateral lunge, stand tall, and do a single leg deadlift. Lateral lunge, stand tall, and do a single leg deadlift. 30 seconds each side. In three, two, one. Here we go. You're going to lateral lunge, push off strong, find that RDL. Lateral lunge for that RDL, for that reach. You only got to go about mid shin. Hinge at the hips too. Hinge at the hips too. <sighs> Lateral lunge, big push off. Hinge at the hips or that RDO. 30 seconds each side of these. <sighs> Three, two, one, go. Other side, other side. Go. 10, 9, 3, 2, 1, 20 second rest, two more rounds of those, so you want to hop sideways? Yeah. Alright, we're going to do lateral view now for more space, but once again, lateral hop, curtsy, you should hopefully know that movement after the first one, and 3, 2, one, here we go, so lateral step, curtsy lunge, hop out, load again, back over, curtsy lunge, hop out, load that leg, hop over. When you load that leg, you can touch the ground again, that's fine. Curtsy lunge, up, load it, back over, keep going. When you do those curtsy lunges, when you land, don't let that knee shift over. That shin should stay vertical throughout the whole movement. So lateral jump, curtsy with the vertical shin, hop out of it, load that foot, back over, three, two, one, resting. Now we're gonna do the lateral lunge with that RDL again, 30 seconds each side. You can this way fine? If you just get up a little bit, we good. Now we're the camera. In three, two, one, here we go. So you're gonna lateral lunge, up tall to RDL. That RDL. Lateral lunge, sit in that single foot squat, be comfortable in that position. Big push off. We're gonna hinge at those hips, hinge at the hip, reach for that mid shin for that RDL. Keep going, keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides, switch sides. Hit pinch, reach for that mid shin on that RDL. Alright, 
right, Nikki, if you're moving, try it. You're coaching them right now. <laughs> Ten. Five, four, three, two, rest. We're going one more round, one more round. So we're getting ready. Lateral jump. It's so dark now. All right, get ready in three, two, one, go. Lateral jump. Take a lateral jump. Drag your knee up. Curtsy lunge. Face the other way. That's why I did that. All right, keep going. Keep going. Fifteen seconds. Curtsy lunge, drive that knee up and jump. Load it back again. In five, four, three, two, and rest. And we're doing a lateral lunge, RDL. Three, two, one, go. 30 seconds each side. Comfortable in that lateral lunge. Stand up tall, hit pinch. Big push off of that lateral lunge. Sit comfortably in that lateral lunge. Once you sit in that lateral lunge, you should be comfortable in that position. Even distribution of weight on that foot. Three, two, one. Ready, other side, go. Lateral lunge, and do a single RDL. You don't have to go all the way to the foot for the reach of the RDL, just stick your butt back, hinge at the hips, feel those hamstrings, halfway. What are you feeling in your lower back? Are you doing it wrong? Yep, you're bending forward too much then. You gotta keep your chest high. In three, two, one, and rest. All right, we're getting ready for round two of exercises. All right, so our next set of exercises, we're gonna start off with a 20 second pull squat again, and then we're gonna do split lunge jumps. We're gonna go lunge jump, and then we're gonna do a lateral jump as we're switching our foot. So if that lateral split lunge jump is gonna look like we're gonna be here, and we're gonna lateral jump as we go through. Actually, the inside foot should be the foot that goes down. Inside foot is the foot that goes down. Lateral split lunge jumps, and we're comboing that with the static lunge and runners. Those will be 20 seconds each side. So first off, we've got 20 seconds of pull squats. 20 seconds of pull squats. In three, two, one, here we go. If the bottom of the squat is 0%, top of the squat's 100%, we're trying to stay in between about 30 and 70% of the movement. 10. Five, four, three, two, rest. All right, so remember, you're gonna do a split lunge. When you come up in that split lunge, you're gonna try a lateral hop. Your inside foot is gonna be the one that's always stepping back. If you have trouble with that movement, just do regular static or single jumping lunges in a stationary position. We're gonna face this way. All right. I'll go back and go front. Ready? 30 seconds of these. In three, two, one, here we go. Just trying to get a lateral jump in between those split lunges. Now you're gonna work that brain a little bit. How are you gonna get that body to move laterally? 15. There's gonna be a big lateral movement. We're just trying to move laterally as much as we can. Three, two, one, rest. What we got going next part is we're gonna stay in a static lunge and we're gonna move our arms as if we're running as fast as I can. At the halfway point, we're gonna switch our foot position and keep those arms running. 
Arms gonna be running for 40 seconds total. Legs will switch at the halfway point. Our lunge should be nice, equally distributed, 90 degrees at the knees, and we're just powering those arms through the run. Ready? If you seem dumb and dumber, it's gonna look like you're incredible running at an incredible rate. In three, two, one, find that lunge. Big movements on those arms. Be equally distributed weight through that front foot and that back foot. Front knee should have 90 degrees on it. Five, four, three, two, switch, go, go. Big movement with the arms, drive elbows back, drive hands forward. Come on, let's go. I'm beating Nikki right now. I'm running faster than her. Let's go, come on, keep it, keep it. Five, four, three, two, one. We're up. Woo, burning those legs, burning those legs. 10 till we go again, 10 till we go again. Even alternative for some people for the jumping lunge? Jumping lunge, you can't jump lunge, just step back to it. Three, two, one. Inside foot goes back. Inside foot goes back. If you can't jump laterally with it, you can just do stationary jumps, or you can just step the back lunge. Just try to keep moving. Can you back at all? Ten, nine. Remember, you're trying to jump laterally, move laterally. Three, two, one, rest. Woo, 20 second static lunges, each side. Pump those arms, pump those arms. Try to stay stable in this position. Be in control of it. Three, two, one, here we go. Right, my foot, the weight in my front foot is equally distributed from the big toe, the back left corner, and the back heel. All that tripod makes a nice, stable foot. Back foot stable, we feel balanced, and moving those arms. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, switch, go, switch, go, go. Find that balance, find that balance. Pump those arms, let's go, come on. Find the breathing, don't hold your breath. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, we're up. Shake those quads out, shake those quads out. We got one more cycle through it, one more cycle through it. You can't laterally Jump those back lunges, right? We can just step a back lunge. Let's try to keep working for it. Try to keep working for it. Three, two, one. Here we go. Try to challenge yourself. How far can you jump on that lateral lunge? Cover some ground. Halfway, come on. Come on. I got you, let's go, let's go. Five, don't stop. Rest, Woo. it's a quad burner. Oh. Catch your breath, catch your breath. We're running it, last time with them. Running it back, running it back. Three, two, one, drop into it. Big motions, elbows drive back, arms drive forward. Head up, head up, chest up. Five, four, three, two, switch and go, switch and go, switch and go. Arms, pump those arms. Pump those arms, get you there. Woo. Come on, 10, nine, pump, 
pump, go, five, four, three, two, rest, oh yeah, oh yeah, we're working on round three next, working on round three next, all right athletes, coming up next, obviously we're going to start with 20 seconds of pull squats, then we're going to do a low lunge step through, if you did Nookie's workout yesterday, you've seen that movement, we're going to add a little variation to it, and then we got staggered squat hops. We're going to do 20 seconds on each leg, oh sorry, 30 seconds of the lunge step throughs because we switch foot during that, and then we're going to do 20 seconds each side of those staggered squat hops. So what we're going to see for the step through lunges is right, we're going to be in a low lunge. My quads are blown up, so I feel you, this hurts already. So we're going to get in that static lunge position. This is going to suck. We're going to step forward, step back, on the back step, we switch our feet. Step forward, step back, switch your feet. Staying low the whole time. Our second movement is we're gonna have this little staggered squat. And we're gonna go into a squat hop. Our idea though is to put all the emphasis in your front foot. So you're almost doing a single foot squat hop. If that hurts, you're gonna do 40 seconds of squat hops or just 40 seconds of squat. Right now we got pull squats for 20 seconds though. Hope you're with me, let's go. In three, are you with me? Yeah. She's with me. Stay three of legs. Two, one, pulse it out, pulse it out. You probably feel those quads all pumped out like I do. Mmm, you have my chips on the ground just in case. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, we're resting. I'm gonna show you one more time. You switch the lunge in the back. So we're gonna start here. We step through that low lunge. We step back, we switch that feet. We step through that low lunge, step back, switch the feet. You're always switching on the back lunge. 30 seconds of these, and we're working in three, two, one. Start in that running position. Step forward, step back, switch your feet. Step forward, step back, Look at the hands, look at the hands. Opposite hand goes with the opposite foot. If you need a relief from these, stand up taller. It's burning. 10, nine, look at the hands. Three, two, one. Oh man. Yeah. Staggered squat jumps. One foot just step back a little bit. We're gonna squat. Try to hop all our weight in that front foot. If anything bothers you during this, do squat hops as long as you can, and then go into squats if you need to. All right, 20 seconds, each staggered foot. In three, two, one, go. So this is my squat. I'm gonna step back with my right foot a little bit. All the weight. It's going as much as I can in that front foot. Trying to lean forward too much with your chest. Keep your chest high. Three, two, switch feet. Regular squat, little back step. Oh, yeah. Ten, nine, five. Four, three, two, rest. Somehow, we're gonna make it through two more rounds of these. Yeah! Woo I don't know what day it is for you watching this, but it's a good day to work out, you know it. Let's push a little, let's push a little. Taco Thursday. It's Taco Thursday for us. In three, staggered, step through, two, one, go, step through, look at the arms, switch those feet, with switch fit, feet switch, arm switch. It should always be the opposite arm of the leg, just like if you were running. It's on that back switch, those arm switch too. Let's keep those arms with it, just keep a little more active movement. Stop texting me, Cassandra. Three, two, one. Oh, yeah. 20 seconds, 
staggered. And this is my squat. Stepping back a little bit. Don't collapse in. Keep a high chest. You have that back foot. To let you sit your butt back. 20 seconds each side. Three, two, one. Here we go. Back foot's more of a kickstand to help you with your balance. We're trying to put all that weight in front foot. 10, nine. You might just maybe squat it if you can't jump it. Three, two, tall, back, go. This is mean, she says. Come on, 10, 9, 8, go. 5, 4, 3, 2, rest. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Count how many times you shake my head in this video. Count how many times Nikki shakes her head. I can't see her. You guess right. You get to do burpees. One, more round of those. Use those arms. Follow those arms. Three, two, one, go. Arms, boom, switch. Step back. We're only switching the feet and back. Stay tall with the chest. Tall with the chest. We should be able to see the logo on your shirt. If you can't make that jumping back, just step that transition. Woo! Yeah! Now the floor is getting slippery. Three, two, one. Woo. I don't know if I can stand up. Uh, one more round of this? Stack your squat hops. Then we got one more set of exercises. I think. Stagger squat hops. Maybe you're just doing that single foot squat. Maybe regular squats. 40 seconds total. Three, stagger, ready, and go. My cast my quads in for Come on, leg. Come on, leg. Ready, and Switch, go. Last split lunge jump. 10, 9, 8, 3, 2, 1. Woo! Good riddance to those. We got round four. Coming up. All right, athletes. If you need more rest, pause it, take a rest. That's why they're recorded. Go at your own pace. What we got next is gonna be toe taps. So you can imagine an item, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna kinda imagine there's like a tennis ball or something in front of us. If you need that reference, grab a cooler or something like that. But that's all it's gonna be is like little toe taps. <laughs> My legs flex a minute. Right, we're gonna do those for 20 seconds, real quick, real explosive, really focusing on those arms like we have been all workout. We're gonna combo these with a low rotation chop. This is something you would normally see with a band doing like a wood chop, but since we don't have that band, all we're gonna do with our blown up legs, it's gonna be fine. We're gonna get, <laughs> my legs are so tired. We're gonna get in the squat form, we're gonna rotate to the side, so we're almost in that lunge position, and then we're gonna go side to side. Side to side. Explosive, using our hips to turn. 20 seconds of those, three rounds. So this one could be so extensive with squats, it's gonna be movement, movement, movement. Three rounds, 20 seconds. But you already know what we got first. 20 seconds of pull squats. Let's get it started. In three, two, one, pull squats. I'm sweating. If you're not watching this today, it's hot today. It's hot today. Five, four, three, two, rest. I might need a towel for this one. I'm gonna dry the floor real quick. 
We got toe taps to start. Those are gonna be explosive. Using our arms, pretending like you have something in front of you. The goal is to have only one foot on the ground at a time. Sorry. Right, just like you're trying to tap something. High knees will work, running in place will work, jumping jacks will work, but try to kind of mimic like your toe tapping. And then I'll remind you what that next movement is after this. 20 seconds of each one. And three toe taps first. Two, one, one and a half, and go. So you want to try to stay on your toes. Stay on your toes the whole time, this one. Arms are still going, opposite arm, opposite leg. So I guess it's a high knee, but feet are coming out more in front of us. Five, four, three, two. If your knees hurt because your quads are so pumped out and that bothers, you can always just do high knees walking. All right, next movement is we're gonna start in a squat. Right hand hands out. We're gonna chop to the side, get that almost lunge. Chop to the other side, get that lunge. Start slow, it's probably better on tile if you're on a carpet, just don't mess up your carpet. Find a rhythm, and then we're gonna try to explode through this movement. Take your shoes off, you're on carpet. Don't fall down though. All right, three, two, one. So we're gonna start slow. Up slow. Pivot those hips, pivot those feet. I'm gonna go slow again one more time. Try to turn those toes too. Don't put too much torque on those knees. Woo. Three, two, one. Slipping and sliding all over the place. This felt a lot better when I was practicing them. Work it on. Toe taps. Three, two, one, go. Remember, if your knees bothers, what you can do. It's just kind of pretend like you're marking them. We're just trying to move through this whole time. Five, four, right, this is what you can do with the butter knees. Two, rest. We're gonna change that up a little bit. I think if we're gonna get more out of it, if we go slow on those. Same movement, don't worry about that speed. We're trying to get to lunge, to lunge, all right? Trying to get to a lunge, rotation, it's a lot of rotation in today's workout. Three, two, start in the squat, here we go. Rotate to lunge, rotate to lunge. It's in those hips, it's in those hips. See how that back foot pivots all the way? Back foot pivots all the way. Three, two, one. Yeah, that was better, that was better. Slow control is always better. Toe jabs, high knees, jumping jacks, something like that, whatever gets you moving this round. Three, two, one, go. Those are actually bothering my knees, so I'm gonna demonstrate how you can do jumping jacks. Still working the same muscles. Three, two, one, rest. One more round of those low wood chops. Right, it's all on that pivot of that foot. Just like if you're swinging a bat, very functional movement. Three, start in a squat. Two, one, here we go. Rotate, rotate. Make sure you find that position, stable, then rotate. 10, 9, 8, Woo, 3, 2, 1, round 4 complete, we got our final round, round 5, get ready for it, if you need more rest, hit pause and take it, we're getting ready for round 5. Alright athletes, we're here on our final round of exercises besides for our finisher. So what we're gonna do is it's gonna be 20 seconds of pull squats again, 
And then we're gonna try to go two rounds, maybe three, we'll see how it feels. Two rounds of single footed wall sit. 20 seconds one foot, 20 seconds the other foot. If you can't do a single foot wall sit, I recommend just trying to do a wall sit for the full 40 seconds or as long as you can with it. We're unleashing the beast. I guess she finished her treat already. Licking all her sweat. Slow motion coming over to lick my sweat. All right, athletes, 20 seconds pole squats. Then we're gonna go into 20 seconds single leg wall sets too. We'll see how we feel for maybe three rounds. We got pole squats in three, two, one. We go. I can't remember the last time I did a single foot wall sit and I didn't practice them. So it's about to be live. I've never done one. Well, she's never done one. It might turn into regular walls at 10, 9. We're about to fight him out. This should be fun. 3, 2, 1. We're resting 20. Might have to find a towel to hold us up. All right. It's about to get live. As live as it can get. Oh man, all right. Three. What's it look like? What's a single leg wall sit? <laughs> what does a single leg wall sit look like? All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get into a wall sit, take the leg off. It's actually probably better, since your quads are all pumped out, to just try to lift your leg up where you can stick it out. All right, remember if you can't do this single leg, you're just gonna try to do a wall sit for the remaining time. Three, two, one, go. Try to take a leg off the ground. And it's up to watch. What? Can you start it now? Yeah. 10, woo! My foot's off the ground, you can see it. Five, four, three, two, switch legs, switch legs, go. You can always do a regular wall sit if you need. Yes, yes. Nope, can't do that. Can't do that. Five, four, three, two, switch. Switch, go. Woo! My hip's cramping. Come on. Woo! Five, four, three, two, Switch. Maybe you're just wall sitting. Maybe you're just wall sitting. Maybe you just have to do squats and you can't even wall sit. Ten, nine. This is the end of round four. We should start three. Three, two, one. Switch again. Switch again. Like a pearl. Come on. Come on. Decent pace with them. All right, 10 squats. We're going in three, two, one. 10 squats. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, 
two, up, nine squats, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, nine second hold, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, I'm unleashing the beast, three, two, one, up, eight squats, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, eight second hold, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, up, seven squats, seven, stay with me, six, five, four, three, two, seven second hold, seven, six, five, four, three, two, up, six squats, six, five, four, who thought of this, three, two, six second hold, six, five, four, three, two, up, let's go, five, five, four, three, two, five second hold, five, four, three, two, up, four squats, go, four, three, two, four second hold, four, three, two, up, three squats, one, two, three second hold, three, two, one, two squats, one, two second hold, two, one, one second hold, 10 burpees, go, just joking, just joking. Ugh. I recommend, once you stop this video, do some quad stretches, maybe go out and take a walk and flush some of this lactic buildup out. A lot of quad work today. No planks though, if you did yesterday's workout, I had all those planks in it, that was nasty. Then if you did Nikki's glute workout yesterday, uh, that's probably had it up. Great job today. Workout 24 is done. Share this video, share this video. Uh, go out, get some sunlight on your skin. It's good for you. You're all probably pasty white from staying inside so long. <laughs> all right guys, have a great blessed day. Once again, thanks for joining us. Workout 24 in the books. Check out this, this hair, quarantine hair.